The League War is underway, friends. We are absolutely steamrolling. It's really not a challenge, to be honest. We just pieced out the Commonwealth and took a large portion of land over here in the Ru in the Rus. Uh, so life is good. Life is good. Welcome back, everybody, to Lion of the North. Hope that you have been enjoying the run. For some reason, these rebels insist on sieging down Moscow, even though they are Commonwealth rebels. Kind of annoying. I feel like they should probably get off my... You kids need to get off my lawn. Uh, but what we're doing right now is we're going to win the war, but I'm waiting on this trade station so we can build a ton of um, uh, manufacturers up here in these fur provinces. That'll be really solid. Now, hopefully they don't win it. Oh, 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 oh. hey, <laughs> they got off the province. They heard the footsteps coming. Ragusa. All right, cool. So, I mean, we might as well separate piece everybody else out. There's no reason not to. Okay, or not. You guys are silly willies. Hungary wants out. Milan wants out. Milan is full occupied. Let's have them get annexed. Why not? Reduce the number of tags. We can't enforce demands. Oh, we can we can force peace on them. Yeah, this is fine. Just let, let them sit with some occupations. Why not? You know, it doesn't hurt me. The longer this war goes on, honestly, the better it is for us. We can speed five this war, to be honest. We are definitely going to have rebels out here, though. So let's keep this army out here. Now, I kind of feel like I should shuffle my army a bit, but this is fine. We'll keep these guys here. Clearly, we win. We're now we're just hanging out. Obviously, these cores need to be done before we can do much else uh, over here. Now, I don't really need to add this to the trade company, to be honest. So I think I won't. But uh, yeah, now we're just chilling, waiting on um, this. Next idea group, what do we want it to be? Could go with like a expansion, right? We've got colonial range. We've actually got some colonies over here. So I say we go expansion. Man, England controls most of this over here. Spain is over here. And then all of Portugal is South America. Portugal's over here. We could go expansion. I mean, I'm not opposed to it. I kind of want to switch over to this. We said we needed to do this. Because which one was it down here, right? Uh, reform the military. We need to have 753 mil power. Gaining 16 mil mana per month. Okay. That, this is going to be expensive, but we can totally do this. We just need to promote one of these guys to a level five. So 1500 ducats. And, uh, that actually should open that up, right? Oh, we just need to have the extra mill mana. Yeah, it's fine. We can afford this guy. <laughs> level five, that's nothing, right? Let's get that guy up to a level three at least as well. So, uh, yeah. How about it? I'd say that's a pretty solid win. Innovativeness sounds good. Life is good, lads. Life is good. I love this song too. Imperator Rome, great soundtrack. Great, great soundtrack. So let's start piecing people out that are willing. You guys want out, so I will give you money, or you will give me money and trade power. Again, like, you just go down the line here, click on everybody who, you know, hasn't already joined you, and you force convert them, and look at that. Love it. Protestants looking pretty good in this war. Um, Lanshut. Lanshut is not Protestant, so there you go. No, you don't have a say. This is what you have to deal with. Um, heretic royalty, 10 years. I don't really want that. I guess I'll lose the prestige. We have another reform. Yes, I am huge on the States General. Honestly, I think we do it. Um, Karl Vasa is young enough that I don't really want to do it right now, though. So... The general states, all loyalty, equilibrium, estates. Calling the diet no longer increases influence, huh? Well, we have our diet. We could get a parliament for a bit. Hmm. This one's still poo-poo. They added diplo rep to it, but it's still kind of bad in my opinion. The army tradition decay is not big enough to make it justified. Stab cost, no stability cost. Yeah, we're going to do this. I'm going to hold on to it, though. 
No, uh, no rush. Wait for um, young Carl here to die, or to be older at least. All right, Lonsu, you ready to peace out? Okay, I don't need your trade power. Oh, really? Now they're feeling good because they got one of their provinces occupied back. Typical. Wait till the yearly tick to take these three techs. All three. Very good. Lost a claim on a province? Feels bad, man. Feels real bad, actually. Papal State has entered into an alliance with our enemy. You bastards. All right. Ottomans have absolutely just gone in and destroyed these guys. All right. L Lonsuit should peace out now. Very good. Perfection. Yes. Very good. We just want to convert everybody. Why not? There's no reason not to, you know? Okay, let's get some claims on Volgas. We need to get claims on both of their provinces, so I will. That's why I was building Spy Network on them in the first place. We now have all of the age objectives. Very good. Um, we have call for pizza. You don't say. The plebs demand pizza. I love that they kept that in this mod. It's one of my favorite things from uh, UIL Artemis. Ingolstadt. Force religion. Trade power. Oh, yeah. I think we've won this war, guys. What do you think? Do you think we've won? Piecing everybody out separately. Force religion, transfer trade power. Oh my gosh. This is so good. Mines? You guessed it. We are going to have a Protestant empire. And there is nobody who has any say about it at all. Look at all these Protestants. Uh, is Ulm in the war? No, Ulm is not in the war. We're also the centers of reformation here. These guys. These guys are actually our ally in the war. Onhalt? Is Onhalt in the war? No, they're not. Well, they are, but they're an ally. You guys will be forced religion. Very good. Ragusa's already our brothers and sisters in the faith. We'll piece them out. Uh, Palatinate, forced religion. You guys guessed it. Forbid the publication is fine, I guess. Geneva? Forced religion, they're too big, really. Okay. Uh. Oh, wait. Yeah. Geneva. Oh, they're a subject. Right. I'm being dumb. These guys are definitely too big, though. So let's go ahead and take their trade power. Have you break off any useful alliances? Sure. Sounds good. Give money, please. More money, please. Force religion, all that stuff. Oh, my gosh. It's so good. Now, we don't do this for any reason other than it's just, it's funny. And remember, we're a defender of the faith. So, tier four. So, it looks like, yeah, we want to get up to 50. 50 is our goal. But, um, who knows? I don't really know how much longer we'll play after we get our achievements. But, um, this is fine. So, you guys are going to give us religious supremacy. As well as war reps. It says I can take provinces, huh? Oh, no, I can give them to people. No. This is fine. Oh my gosh, look at the devastation in these provinces. <laughs> oh, look at Poland. Like this land. Like this is it. This is why we did this. Because this province is devastated. Oh, it is. Even though they're out of the war. Ah, they're in a different war. Now I'm curious if those wars were chained together. Because we devastated. We I scorched this province. And even though they control it, it's still gaining devastation. Because it was looted or because it was scorched. So it looks like all of these provinces are still gaining devastation despite them being in control. That is awesome. That is a uh, based as the kids say. So, so religious supremacy, war reps and a humiliate. Yep. Uh, I could take money. How much money will I get? No, not much. So I don't care about that. Um, Transfer tree power is fine. Take whatever money you're willing to give me. And just like that, Lion of the North. Very good. And uh, it was quite easy, to be honest. European politics, huh? <laughs> 1,000 development. Sounds good. Let's go ahead and go with... Dun, 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 dun. We get a Kungling Ambassador. And uh, we get a Diplo Rep guy who's half off. Heck yes. Now, we also want these... I still need a bit more mill mana. But aside from that, we should be good. All of the following must be true. I'm looking at the bottom one. Employing a mill advisor of level 3. We have a level 5. We just need the mill mana, and we're gaining 16 mil per month, which we are. We should be good then. I believe we're good. Uh, on the yearly tick, we'll take these three techs here. All three of them stay ahead of time. 
Oh, pfft. as I'm trying to finish that tech. Do we go? I don't think we go expansion, though. I think, if anything, we just wait 100 years and we start uh, yoinking people's colonies, right? What about espionage? It got buffed. I'm curious. I'm, I, I've, I've had my interest peak. Yearly army tradition decay is nice. Um, what else we got? Innovative stab cost and diplomats. Eh, it's okay. Um, what about aristocratic? Aristocratic also got buffed. Cav, cav combat ability. Mill tech cost. Um, yearly absolutism. Dev cost is new, I believe. Army tradition decay. Okay. What does this do with innovative? Production efficiency and trade gives trade merchants and trade abroad. Hmm. Questionable. Questionable. Could go with a quantity. Quantity got nerfed. Offensive, you know, gives siege ability. Screw it. Let's go uh, offensive. But, and this is a big but, we're going to wait until we uh, get this mission. Because we need this mission. This is going to, we'll lose that mill mana, of course. Uh, while having 75 absolutism or miltech 19, not spend the mill mana. Right. The allotment system of Sweden. Okay, so I think the allotment system is what allows us to get the uh, Carolingian infantry, uh, I believe. I might be wrong. Uh, Latin Caracola. Very good. Okay, cool. And we have these guys now. So let's go ahead and sort by... Well, it'd probably be better to just click it all and individually. But yeah, these, um, these trade goods are very, very lucrative. It's going to be quite useful for our income here. As we steer these guys in. Fish. Right, we have so much money coming in from fish. Very good. All right, cool. So we should probably uh, get our armies together as well. Right, I have an army black flag. Where? Oh, hey. What's up, guys? Get you guys in Moscow. What rebels are we going to have? Teutonic separatists. Yeah, understandable. We did take Tukola. Luckily, they should spawn on Tukola. So we have a fort there, which would be really useful. Not bad, though, huh? I uh, actually think that that was a bit easier than it was the, the previous time I did it. But yeah, we need to make sure that we do this. Oh, our air died. That's funny. While he's alive. Or we have at least a guy with at least four mil mana. Because otherwise, we're not going to be able to do it. But it's fine. We should be good. I'm going to hold off. I'm going to hold off. <laughs> we'll be good. We're gaining so much mil mana that um, it's fine. Portugal. You want to PU? Rivalry attitude. They are rivalry. Rivalrous, rivalrous towards me. Okay, guys. Sounds good. <laughs> I don't think that's very smart of you, but that is fine with me. And uh, now that we are done with this, you can see, like, we can just come on over. Oh, Nassau. <laughs> Nassau's the... Uh, they call in a bunch of their friends, but it uh, doesn't really matter a whole lot to me. We definitely need to be getting our spy network on these guys, though. Rugen. Get some spy network. Get some spy network. We're going to need to get claims on all these guys. We are currying our favors with the uh, auto man, which is good. Make sure we are keeping that up. Let's go ahead and, um, damn. These are all pretty long, to be honest with you. This guy's half off, yeah? Let's get you up to level five. Plenty of income. I'd rather have extra mana than money. At this point, because clearly our uh, income is is solid. Um, let's build that there. Oh, so good, dude. We were making so much freaking money. <laughs> and as these manufacturers finish, we will make even more. That's the crazy part. Nice. They spawned on a fort. Oh, no, they didn't. There you, there's a fort there. In 1444, but just not right now. That is fine. And now for this Sweden is not overpowered achievement. Uh, where is it with that? Sweden, Sweden, S, 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 S. Where's S? It's before T. Sweden is not overpowered. We just need these provinces, which I'm getting claims on as many of them as possible at the moment. Saxony is going to war with some people. Fine. I don't care. All right, how you guys doing? I'll get my uh, participation here. I'm curious to get the Carolingian or Carolin Carolingian. Let's just head on over here. It's no problem. 
But this will give me lots of war participation for having a big old juicy army in the sieging them down. Come on, baby. They stay. <laughs> How's it feel, idiot? Goodbye. One more month. Ah, there we go. Lose 752 mil mana, but we get the allotment system. Feel free to stop and read, but uh, this will unlock the allotment system reform for monarchies. Uh, tier 5 reform, which will give us Carolin Car Carolians. Car I say Carolingian. Carolian infantry. Um, and we also will gain manpower and primary culture. Ooh. Really? Mein Gott. Tier 5? Okay. This is totally fine with me. Oh, that's hilarious because I was converting provinces. So we can do 34 Carolians. So what do these guys get? Um, does it say anything specific about what they do? Maybe I have to recruit one. 10% of our total um, culture provinces development. Okay. So, yeah. As long as we are converting these guys, we should be good. This stuff down here is like really high development though. So... I'll, I'll continue converting though. It's fine. <laughs> Doesn't bother me any. Um, yeah, like that's a lot of dev though. Ah, whatever. It's fine. And then, um, yeah, let's convert these guys over here as well. No Icelandic identity this time. You guys are Swedes. All Swedes. All right. Um, perfect. Yeah. And we're already mostly up to stab three. Now, how old are you? 41. Damn. He is a good King, a good emperor. Very good emperor. I am a, uh, I am happy with this. Um, sure. I don't care about a couple of duckaroons. Doesn't bother me any. Now I would like for them to like force convert them. That would be really good if they did that. Let's get some claims. They definitely got rid of the, uh, the whole HRE provinces cost extra. They definitely got rid of that because it used to, it used to be 30. Uh-huh. I claim on you. Don't need that anymore. So as long as I have my claims, let's see here. Attack you guys. NASA will join. Don't care. Very good. All I need is Vismar. I don't need to call anybody else in. Now, I think what I should do is head on down and siege down Nassau. Let's give that to Saxony. And as long as I can keep the Emperor kind of like beat up, then we should be fine. Free stability. Heck yeah, bro. I love stability. Don't you guys love stability? I know I do. Uh, I do want to convert this stuff. Let's go ahead and convert it. Let's uh, get rid of you and go with conversion strength. Yeah, I'll make it a bit quicker, which is nice. These guys are over here sieging down my stuff. Oh no, anyways. Let's put you guys, let's give these guys this one here. The local defensiveness. Extend those siege ticks just a bit. Because these provinces being kind of like a border border province, they, are, they do get sieged down quite often. There you go. All I want is this province. That's it. That's it. That's all I want. Get a disease outbreak like you do. Get on over here and start sieging these lads down. Where are you guys going? Nassau, huh? Yeah, that's what I thought, Mr. Emperor Man. How you feeling? <laughs> oh, yikes. Okay. <laughs> so Nassau has no army now. I will go ahead and I will scorch this province. There's a fort, so it'll... They'll be fine. Um, but then what I do... What, what kind of war, war uh, exhaustion are you at? Two. So let's go ahead, white piece them. And I should be able to take this now. Very good. I will core this up. Of course. I will attack these guys. Nassau will join. <laughs> Can you guys see? We're going we're gonna to do a little bit of rinse and repeat here. Let's get a claim on this province here. And we need to be getting some spine network on you guys as well. Because we need to get claims on these two provinces. All right. Let's attack you. Nassau will join. I do not care. Rugen will join. I will co-belligerent Rugen. Um, I would like to co-belligerent Stettin, but I cannot. So I can white piece them. This is fine. Yeah, this is perfect. Yep, this is totally fine. Um, and we can just come on down here. Somehow, 
I didn't pay attention, and now I'm at war with my former ally. But that's okay. I, I don't really care, to be honest with you. They were not uh, not a good friend. Oof. Hold on a minute. Should probably upgrade my ships, yeah. Let's uh, hunt enemy fleets in the Baltic. This is my all-galley fleet, so this is fine. I do not want you guys blockading me or thinking it is okay to blockade me in any way, shape, or form. Luckily, we've got some forts to handle most of this. Yeah. Definitely just want to keep them out of my lands. Won the Siege of Rostock. Very good. There you go. Very good. And we're just going to have to siege some guys down. A little bit of extra war score. All I want is to take these three provinces, which I have claims on. Everybody else, everybody has been belligerented or co-belligerented. That needs to be, so that is fine. Yeah, they're sieging down this land over here, and that is uh, not really a big deal to me. None of it is even stated up, so it's not really an issue. Now... They are going to get a full annex, so that's going to be a little little more painful. Probably won't be able to get it as quickly, but this is fine. Yep, and since we're ahead of time on mill, we're going to just push through these guys real quickly. They sieged down Riga, and they sacked it, you bastards. You rat bastards. You just need to peace out Saxony and and uh, then uh, siege down Prague. We should probably get some Corolians. So let's get some Corolians. We got enough for five, so let's get five Corolians. All right, let's get down down to. Um, yeah, we might as well get them off my forts then, or at least siege back my forts. Get started on it. That's fine. I'll take the money. We've sieged down Dresden, so that's good. That means we can probably piece these guys out soon. There you go. You guys will break off any alliances that are useful. Nassau for sure. Give me your money. All right, so that frees up quite a bit of their numbers. Oh, they got a lot of men. My goodness. Imagine if it was like, imagine if they were like decent. All right. So Corolians give, uh, what does it say? Morale damage and regiment drill loss. So they just get, keep better drill. So they're, they are better at drilling. Sounds good. My general is dad. Let's uh, just come on over and just start stack wiping their armies. Yeah. Seems appropriate. I can march through all here, which is good. And I shall. Obviously, these forts are uh, to be defended at all costs. You shall have nothing from them. They have sieged down quite a few of my forts, though. Let's get another general over here. Uh, we've sieged down Prague. So uh, feel free, if you are of legal drinking age, to pour up a, uh, a shot of your favorite alcoholic beverage. And uh, take a shot for Prague. It's a tradition around here, right? We take shots whenever we siege down Prague. All right. So let's uh, have you guys siege this stuff back. I think we are basically done now. Yep. We're now roughly even in numbers. Who would join me? Sure. England, come on in, baby. Come on in. The more, the merrier. Let's make sure we are building these manufactories. We also need to be... Um, we need to be, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Um, I forgot what I was trying to say. Yeah, we got some grain, might as well. But yes, we need, we need to be, um, upgrading our forts. Definitely. Definitely need to be doing that. Let's get you guys off that. You have no right to be on my fort here. This is wood, so it should be a stack wipe. Yes, it was. Very good. And uh, we are crushing their navies. Lubeck has lost their navy, which is great. Uh, very good. Bamberg is now gone. These guys are going to get uh, ganged up on over here. So Bamberg. Let's get on Dortmund's army as well. Or their fort over here. And uh, peace out, Bamberg. Let's see here. Let's get another na another general. Get on to Nassau here. Bamberg, I've come to bargain. You shall give me this stuff. Oh, wait. They are a subject. Of whom? Erzberg. Okay, well, I'm occupying your, your ruler's capital as well. So transfer your trade power and all your money. And there you go. 
And now the numbers are even worse in their favor. Perfect. Uh, are they reinforcing? Doesn't look like it. Aha! Later, nerds. Let's go ahead and make sure we get the uh, monthly tick there. Shift consolidate. Head on in. And uh, let the stack and wipe and com commence. Oh, yeah, baby. Look at that. They've lost 94,000 men, and I have lost uh, 54. Pretty good. Uh, we are maxed out on admin. I don't really like doing admin dev, but, I mean, shoot. What's what's the harm? All right. Uh, we also need to head on over. So, I think navally we're good. Let's have you guys head on over and siege down half with you and half over here. Let's get you a few more over here as well. Continue converting as well, especially the more higher, um, whatchamacallit, higher, um, unity provinces. And, uh, I didn't think we were going to, but I, th oof, nice. It's a lot of money. <laughs> Luckily we are filthy rich. So we are going to take those guys here. And just like that, no pro, no, uh, none of that. And we'll take all your money. And just like that, we are super close. Look at this. We have claims on everything we need. We can attack these guys. NASA will join. Oh no, anyways. <laughs> Look at this, dude. Oh, this is so funny. This is so funny. We are just absolutely dominating in every way. And look at this, Nassau's over here. Like, oh no, anyways, I'm just gonna come on up here and get my army ready and we're gonna siege you down again. A 155. Actually pretty solid, to be honest. All right, let's get you guys up here and head down to Magdeburg. Go with uh, tree power. And uh, yeah, we just need to siege these guys down. We're going to continue this. We, we actually will be able to get the uh, Sweden is not overpowered achievement in just in just the next episode, which is pretty sweet. Uh, if you guys are excited for that, make sure you let me know. Leave a like on the video. Subscribe for more. Ding the bell. You'll get notified when I upload new videos. And if you want to join the Discord, the subreddit, the Twitter, those things are all linked in the description below the video. Great way to get involved uh, with the community is support me on Patreon. You'll get early access to Tubert vids. So um, you'll get a little bit of something, something in return while also supporting me like an absolute Chad. And if you are a Giga Chad, that is the way that you do it. All right. But guys, that is all I've got for you for today. This is Chewy Shoot and I will catch you guys later.